You climb the mountain no one else ever has. And then you come in and there's a new system. Is it, is it doubly difficult at 43? Or does age have nothing to do with it? What gives? Well, it's a great question. What, the first thing that happens is your brain tells you, well, there's easier things in this. But you're also, you know, your boss, Bruce Arians, he's had a success, successful system. I mean, the quarterbacks who throw those interceptions came back better in the second year, but they didn't have an offseason either. And this team didn't get to throw with these receivers. There's a lot of adjustment in this. They, they're static, but there's a lot of adjustment. Tom's hesitant sometimes because he doesn't know what each receiver's going to do. Was Godwin for about eight. I think the operative word around here this week was continuity. That's the one you kept hearing about. And that kind of took into account what you're talking about. No offseason, no reps, no preseason, no chance to kind of understand each other, understand how it works. And that's what we're seeing as a result at times. You're exactly right. Second and two. They pick up the first down for net. Able to along the ground and pick up enough yardage for their fourth first down. People say, look at the weapons now. You get Gronkowski to come over, you get Antonio Brown to sign. Godwin, what a year he had a year ago. And Mike Evans has had a sensational seven years in the league. First and ten. Good job picking up the rush. And there's Gronkowski across the middle for a big gain just when the Bucks needed it. Uh, I don't know if you can hear it at all, but he says, hey, here comes a blitz. I want you guys to block these, but he also looks right. He sends Gronk up the middle. Gronk, get out quickly and look. And he knew that the defensive end was covering him. A couple of plays that New England's run before, and this is just helping the quarterback, the quarterback helping the team. And that's a 29-yard gain. That's a completion of a pass over 20 yards, which was a big subject this week. Perfectly from that time, and here he is from the pocket. Going underneath. Going to Ronald Jones. High step it down the sideline. Did he stay in? Touchdown. Well, you called it on Jones earlier. His ability, it flashes. Fournette with a few drops last week hurt the team. Jones flashes those abilities. You see it there. High stepping, just like Jim Nance. He first got on CBS. Watch this play. Let's see if he's in, though. Play action. Time for Brady. Does he stay in? This is the question right about here at the 12. Oh, my goodness. I see enough green for it to be a touchdown, no doubt. Are greener pastures ahead? Uh, maybe. See what I did there? Maybe so. That was play on words. Yes. Wow, that's an incredible play by Jones. That jump starts this Tampa Bay need at that. 37-yard touchdown. Finishing off an 86-yard drive after the fumble. This so easily could have been 24 zip. And instead, the extra point coming from Suckup. And it makes it a 10-point game. Big turnaround. Jones, he had a drop early last week. Not this time. Big time play and a touchdown.